All right, I am outside because we are getting ready for another big game. The Steelers are on a streak, and Chef Bill Fuller, the Big Burrito Restaurant Group, is here to give us an award-winning recipe. Can we call it award-winning? Sure. Okay, let's sure. just Sure, whatever do it. award you want to call it. It's, it's winning, anyways. This is the 11 burger, and we're tailgating a little bit, as you can see. Yeah. And um, I want to talk a little bit about burgers. So we're going to start cooking the burger, we're going to make a salad to go with it, and then we're going to come back to it. So this is our burger, and it's an 80-20 blend of ground beef. Now what that means is it's 80% lean and 20% fat. And one of the important things that you see in a burger isn't, has nothing to do with like water. That's all about fat. And so the higher fat content you have in a burger, the juicier it's gonna be. So you want a little bit of that. You, the 20% seems like a good amount, right? Yeah, yeah. that's, that's 80, 20 is a good number. Okay. If you wanna be nervous, you can go to 15%. If you wanna be indulgent, go to 25%. Past 25% is kind of disgusting. Okay, good to know. A very important <laughs> thing that people often neglect about burgers is to season well. So I just wanted to season this and start it. That's pepper I'm putting on right there. And it's, it's, it's a lot. A yeah. lot of pepper and a lot of salt. So salt, pepper, and fat are what makes your burger work. Okay. All right. Yeah, don't go crazy. You don't need that much, right? Just like that. Well seasoned. And look at these burgers. On a nice hot spot. Now, Bill, are you superstitious? Do you think, like, do you make these every week for the game? Do people order these at 11 every week? So, not really, because it's Sunday. Yeah. <laughs> so they, they come in at 11, they have brunch. But I like to make burgers with games a lot yeah. at home. So we have these three burgers. We're going to add some cheese. And we're, I'm going to let this cheese melt. We're going to make a little salad. Then we're going to make you your final 11 burger. All right. Oh, doubling up on the cheese, too. I like the way you work. All right. So we're going let this, to let this, let this melt. Now, with your burgers, too, and you asked me if I like the medium, medium well, how I like them, how long do you cook them on each side? Because that's a pretty good thickness on your burgers. So this burger, what did I, I was brought, uh, probably like five minutes on each side. Okay. It depends on how hot your grill is, how thick your burger is, how distracted you get by the game, <laughs> how many beers you've had. Right, all that factors into it. All right, we're going to make, so... We're not, we're not having french fries because I thought deep frying out here might be a lot of work. So yeah. I'm, we're going to a little salad on the Good, side. I love it. Let's eat healthy with All our right. burger. So we have a little baby kale, a little fresh beets, some farro grain, so healthy, so healthy, some shaved radish, a little julienne apple that I've pre-marinated in the vinaigrette, and then this poppy seed white, vinaigrette, white balsamic vinaigrette. We're going to toss it all up. Looks so good. Yeah, this will balance that 20% fat for you. <laughs> All right, we're gonna make a little little pile on the plate here with some crackers that we make in house and a little feta cheese. All right, now burger building time. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Look at that perfect timing on the burger. So, so melty. We have house made buns all right we got a burger look at that we have like where do you go next with this <laughs> freshly crisped bacon oh my goodness all right then we have our veal dob now what this is this is veal breast that we smoke and then braise and we take this braising liquid and cook it down and put it back on it so it's like a gravy oh my god And then crispy onions. So these are onions sliced thinly, tossed in flour, and then fried. I love crispy onion straws. So good. Now, Bill, you're putting this all together. You have to tell me when the Steelers last went to the Super Bowl or what year? La last won the Super Bowl. When, when the we last won the Super Bowl, keep this in mind, folks. Bill, we won't name which show, was on a national morning show and made this burger on TV. Yes. And I was up against an Arizona uh, chef, and he made shrimp and polenta. What kind of football food is shrimp and Don't polenta? Eat. Okay, all right. All right. And so I have to take a bite. So, and it, I put a pick in there so it stayed stable, but I give it a squish and a bite. Okay, all right. David, if I can't talk, I may have to send this back to you, so I'm going to go in for it. Yes. Okay, here we go. All right. Go get it. Another. Yeah. Yes. Oh, I'm so jealous. Mm -hmm. That looks Beautiful. delicious. Mm -hmm. Oh, ho, ho. <laughs> Mm -mm. <laughs> <laughs> All right, she's giving us the thumbs up. So we want to thank Bill Fuller 
and, and I know Heather especially wants to thank Bill Fuller because those burgers look fantastic. And you know what? If they're the secret to why the Steelers are winning, we should all be making them.